hello everyone today i'm going to show you how to make a simple recipe but delicious creamy restaurant style black dal makhani in punjabi uh, these uh, lentils are called kali dal or madi dal uh, these dal infused in smoky flavor with simple spices but perfect when you pair it up with naan roti paratha or rice now so let's check out the ingredients here i have a black urad dal wash and rinse two or three times in fresh water and soak in a deep vessel with enough water for an hour after an hour transfer to a pressure cooker and uh, pressure cook this for two to three vessels or until uh, the lentils are soft and tender allow the pressure to reduce naturally and check the dal pressing with your fingers to check whether it's done like this it's uh, beautifully cooked keep them aside ingredients for gravy i'm going to use yellow mirchi powder called peeli mirchi powder this i got from mangalo this dabba and i'm going to use dansak masala powder for the dry spices here i have from left to right coriander powder cumin powder turmeric powder yellow mirchi powder then i have uh, dansak powder black pepper fennel seed and garam masala powder Add to the chutney grinder cooked urad dal, about two to three tablespoon, and I'm going to add a brown onion, garlic paste, and ginger pieces. I'm going to blend this to a smooth paste like this, and keep them aside. See, it's beautifully pureed. You keep them aside. Here I have amul cream, fresh cream, and uh, soak cashew and poppy seed in hot water for an hour. and transfer to a chutney grinder blend to a smooth paste like this here i have green chili cut green chilies heat oil in a pan add green chili and give it a stir now add this uh, a brown dal garlic ginger paste give it a stir cook until the raw smell of garlic and ginger disappears it will take 2 uh, to 3 minutes once it's nice and bubbly go ahead and add um all the dry spices uh lower the heat if the masala is too dry you can go ahead and add oil now i'm going to add ghee so now add tomato puree Cook this tomato puree until the oil separates from the masala. You have to keep on stirring. You have to cook this in a very low flame. Now go ahead and add cooked urad dal. Stir and cook. And while stirring, mash some lentil with the spoon while the lentils are simmering. This helps to thicken the consistency of the dal. If you want thick dal, you can leave as it is. Otherwise, you can add little water if you want runny dal, a little watery dal. But I like it this way. I'm going to add cashew paste, cashew with poppy seed, and give it a stir. And you have to simmer this for two minutes. Keep on stirring. Otherwise, the bottom of the pan will burn. Add the squeezed lime juice. Give it a stir. now fresh cream amul fresh cream now let's give this dal a smoky flavor smoky uh, method can give a world of a different to this simple dal makes you feel as if you are having a meal in a dhaba so um let's give a uh, dangar flavor this dal is almost uh, done and add a uh, lots of butter and give it a stir let's let's give this uh, dangar method uh, like to give a smoky flavor like restaurant style directly burn the coconut shell or charcoal on top of the gas burner place it in a small bowl or aluminum foil in a dal makhani and pour 1 teaspoon ghee or butter over it place the lid on top of and cover quickly and let it rest for 2 or 3 minutes let the dal soak in the smoky flavor when shell is completely cooled off discard this 
Now let's leave for five minutes. Voila! Enjoy the smoky dal makhani with naan, rotis, rice and paratha. This smoky flavor and creaminess of the lentil. If you uh, love authentic Punjabi food, then you are going to love this dal makhani even more. So I hope you like this recipe guys. Love you and God bless you. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe to my channel. Ciao!